Hey everybody, what's going on? Hope everybody had a great weekend. It is Monday, so you know, it's Monday. How good can it be, really? You know, you're heading back to work after it was a beautiful weekend. Went golfing on Saturday. Uh, I'm just going to do some sharing real quick. As we get ready to roll with the, let's put it up, the golf ball unveiling. I kind of teased this yesterday with a picture. Going to wait for some people to pop in. Uh, I know it's, you know, it's a Monday. People are working. We might not get a lot of people to pop in, but hey, this is a. Uh, It'll be fun. See if anyone pops in. If no one pops in, still going to do it. The video will be there for people to enjoy. And, you know, if no one joins, it'll still be fun. Um, just as a quick breakdown, you know, I went golfing on Saturday and I lost pretty much. I think I put about 10 to 12 balls. Pretty much every ball I had is now gone. So I had to uh, go out and buy a new a new bag. And I only buy the value bag where it's all these used balls, 48 balls in total. And I got it for about $15. I got my golfing hat on. If anyone's wondering what's going on with that, got my good, my it's like my beach slash golf hat, you know. Got that that Carolina feeling of just sitting back and relaxing. So that's what this is all about. But we're here and we're gonna do some golf ball stuff. So here's my bag. Bag of 48 balls. They are used. That's why they're cheap and you get so many. But you know, I was I was peeking through after I bought them. And I was like, man, there's like there's a couple right on the top here where I went, man, that's pretty if you look at the other golf balls, you get like a dozen balls for the same price I got these. And yeah, they're new, but at the end of the day, you really need to spend $15 on 12 balls just because it has Callaway on it. I'm going to sit here and tell you that's that you don't need to do that. So I got two bags over here. We got a good bag and a trash bag. I'm not going to actually throw them away. It's just a matter of, you know, how many good balls do we got? How many bad balls do we got? And we're going to break it down. And for me, when I say good and trash balls, it's basically if I've heard of the brand before, go Chiefs, get out of here. Um, well, you know, with Michael joining, I just remembered this is on and off the field. Dylan from on and off the field. You can catch us on the RTS Sports Network from 3 to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And the live shows on Thursdays from 730 to 830 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I guess I should probably throw that in there. I completely forgot. It's Monday. My head is not here. Well, it's like all over the place, actually. It's just scatterbrained. But uh, this is actually also our NFC South episode week. So if anyone watches this and they're like, hey, I like the NFC South, just hit up the show. We need guests for the NFC South. So, you know, Buccaneers, Saints, Falcons, someone else. I, I don't I'm not. <laughs> uh, maybe the Panthers. I don't know. I'm, I have no idea. I'm pretty sure that's it. But. Hit us up if you want to talk about the NFC South this week, um, Tuesday and Thursday for the live show, Tuesday for our recording episode. But we're going to hit up this golf ball unveiling. Basically, good ball. I've heard of it. Trash ball. It's like some off-brand garbage, something like that. You like, yeah, NFC South, is. this is our last division breakdown. This is the last team, our last division so we're going to be moving on to something new after this, but this is the last one. So if you want to jump in on this, this is the bandwagon division right now. Some might be hopping off of the Saints after some Drew Brees stuff, but hey, the Buccaneers are wide open. Applications, um, they're taking them. That's for sure. So let's hit up our first golf ball because we got 48 to go through. Let's see what we got here. First one, it's a roughed up tailor-made one. But I like ta I use Taylor made clubs. So Taylor made golf ball. That's going in the good bag. I don't know how loud that bouncing is. A pinnacle three. Now pinnacle's not bad. I feel like pinnacle is maybe top five golf ball. 
I know it's not like you, you're going out and I don't think there's a lot of people out there going, yeah, pinnacles. Like that's really oh, boy, that glare from the window. Ugh, you're not gonna be able to read it. But I'm gonna put that in the good one. I'm gonna put that in the good bag because I feel like it's still top five. Pinnacle's not bad. Cut. This just says cut and really fancy writing. Yeah, it's going in the trash. Never heard of cut. And if you if if someone watching this is like, yeah, I use cut, like tell me, and I can know that it's a decent golf ball. Because right now I don't think it is. These are the ones I saw. That was just what in the these just these don't have a name. They're like custom made. They just have like pictures on them. This one's like a fairy, like Tinkerbell. Yeah, that's obviously trash. Someone custom made these and yeah, top not top flight. That's I feel like that's top three. It might be pushed down to four. But Top Flight, excellent. Top Flight XL 2000. So it's like a top-notch brand of Top Flight. That's solid. Another picture one. This one's got a green skull with like flames coming out. No name, just the picture. That's trash. I'm really aiming for like 50% value. Like I want at least half of these balls. If 24 of them get in the good bag... I will be very happy with my with my spending of fifteen dollars on this bag of forty eight golf balls. Max Fly, I I know Max Fly, man. <laughs> I know what Max Fly is. It's not a terrible golf ball. I don't want to put it in trash because it is name brand. I know there's a lot in here that are going to be worse than Max Fly, so I'm going to put it in the good bag. If you disagree with that, I'm sorry, but it's going there because then uh, this is a pinnacle too. But it has Turbine Indiana on it. Like, it might be where it's made. This is, I feel like this is a very old ball. Hot Shot Pinnacle. Uh, it, it, I already put one Pinnacle in the good bag. I know Pinnacle is a good brand, but this one just it might be like a special one. I'm not sure. I'm going to put that in there in the good bag. Top Flight, but it looks like it got like X'd out. I'm not sure what's going on with this one. This camera's terrible. You're not going to be able to see a lot of them. But Top Flight XL, it is Top Flight. It's going in the good bag. Do do. Let's pull out a few here. Here we go. First one, Callaway. The first Callaway we pull out of the bag. It's got some writing on it. Somebody messed with it. They put like a red marker on it. I guess the Noah is theirs, but this is our first Callaway we pulled out. So we got Ding. This should be like a great bag. Trash good and better bag. Callaway would go like top. I put the Taylor made in there too. Callaway, Taylor made. Mm, and if I find any nitros or Nikes in here, that would go into the better too. We'll see. Dunlop, DDH. I don't, I've never heard of Dunlop. That's trash. Top flight system one. Good bag. Let's see here. Pinnacle four, RGH, Pinnacles. I've already put Pinnacles in the good bag. We're going to do that. Nitro one. We got a nitro. That's a good one. Nitros are good. Ultimate distance. Do I know what the difference between a good ball and a bad ball is? I do not. I don't know what makes good thing. What makes one fly? What doesn't make one fly? I don't care. I just I know names. They sell these ones for a lot. Nitros are right up there with Nike, Callaway, TaylorMade. So that's going in the very good bag. Top flight. Let's see, this is why I should have made a third bag. That would be a very good. I would put top flight in a good bag it's not trash but i put it in the good bag so we're definitely outnumbering the trash right now for sure These, this is not terrible oh boy what is this it's an mg4 mg with a little circle around it i have no idea what that is that's trash I've never even heard anyone talk there's a tailor made and see, so we've got a little yellow smiley face on it. Someone wrote on there a little yellow smiley face. Taylor made. It's going in the good bag, obviously. Canadian Club. Nothing else on it except in the front. It says Canadian Club. No, that's trash. Sorry. No idea. Especially since it's can oh, another nitro. That's our second nitro one. Hey, yo. Going in the good bag. We are definitely outweighing the trash so far. I'm liking this. We're maybe almost a halfway through the bag. Let's see here. Top flight one. It's pretty beat up, but it's 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 a top flight. That's a good ball. 
our second Callaway. That's going in our top notch bag if we had one. So we might have had maybe four or five top notch balls. Titleist four. I was on the fence if I was going to put Titleist in the trash or the good bag, but uh, I feel like Titleist has to go. I, I know they use Titleist on the tour. It might not be like every Titleist. Kind, I mean, they might have to use more top notch on the tour, but Titleist isn't terrible. It's definitely. I don't. It might be pushed out of the top five. Another Top Flight XL, Top Flight 3, X out, Top Flight, good bag. We got our first Nike, Nike 3. That's def- that, that would be in our very good bag. Maybe I'll go through my, I'll make another bag and we'll figure out how many really good ones we have. We have a Dunlop. I think I've already put a Dunlop in the trash bag. Um, I don't know. It's it's like, eh, probably not good. Top Flight. Top Flight XL 2000. Here's another picture. We got a flower. That's so pretty. We got a flower on this one. For those just joining, I bought a 40, one of those bags you get for $15 at Walmart. It has 48 used balls in it. We're going through and seeing if I got my value or not. So we got one with a flower on it. This is obviously trash. Right now, our good bag is outweighing our trash bag. But I have to go back through and separate the very goods from just the goods like pull out my callaways my nikes my nitros another oh, i pulled out two pictures so we got two trashes in a row on that maybe all the trash balls are at the bottom this is about to get ugly maybe we're definitely over halfway through another nike no we're good nike two it's our second nike taylor made pretty beat up taylor made but that's good ball pinnacle all right we already talked pinnacle that's a good one Oh boy. Frederick's funeral home. Oh, it's a Titleist though. <laughs> but it has Frederick's funeral home on the side of a Titleist. Very interesting. But it is Titleist. I'll throw it in the good bag. I don't know if it is good. It's a low end. So it says, oh, oh, look at that thing. What is that? Oh, Lordy. These ones with pictures don't have anything else on it. I don't know what kind of golf ball these this is. It's like the lowest brand you could possibly get. And it just has a picture on it. This one's like a pig with buck teeth. Trash. Top Flight XL 3000. We've had a couple Top Flight XL 2000s. This is a 3000. I don't know what difference that makes, but <laughs> Taylor made a very clean Taylor made. Project A. It's a nice ball. And a Warrior Custom Golf. Okay, this is just custom. It says Tor TDS. Uh, I don't know. It says Tor on it. But it says Warrior Custom. If it's custom, I'm not. That's going in the trash bag if it's custom. Self-portrait. Oh, we got jokes. We got jokes. I wore this hat just so people might be nice to me. It's like, oh, like, oh I got another Nitro. Yeah, and I'm getting made fun of thanks richard i got another nitro in here i think that's my second or third nitro that's very exciting a noodle i have hit noodles before this is familiar to me but it is trash this is not gonna that, that, i can't put that in a good bag i can't titleist one not bad pinnacle we already talked pinnacle these like those ones would be in our good bag I got to make another bag for the very goods. I should have had three bags. I'll, I'll do that right after. I only got a couple left here. Pro Tour. Pro Tour 1. Doesn't have a brand except Pro Tour. I don't I don't know. It says Pro Tour, but I don't believe it. Um, it's going in the trash bag. I, I, don't, I never heard of a ball that's just Pro Tour. Pinnacle 2. That'd be in the good snake eyes whoa oh man i wish this glare wasn't here snake eyes it's trash but it's a cool name i mean if i've heard of it before if it wasn't like some no-name brand oh third callaway callaway four it has butterfinger on the side of this one like a actual picture of a butterfinger nifty 
I like that one. That's probably the, my favorite one I've pulled so far. And these last four. Pinnacle. Pinnacle. Hopkins. Hopkins golf ball is not going to cut it for value. And we have a gold lady breast cancer ribbon on the side of a Pinnacle 4. I like that one. It's a nice nifty golf ball. So really quickly, it's already been 15 minutes. I know everyone's busy. It's a Monday. we got to work. Um, I'm quickly going to go back through the good bag and pull out my very goods. Um, it might be easier to pull out just the goods. So my Pinnacles, my top flights, um, they're going to go into the good bag. And now I'm going to really, really break this down into what you want. Uh, Taylor, uh, Taylor made. Should Taylor made be good or very good? I feel like Taylor, Taylor made should just be good. I'm just a fan because my clubs are Taylor made. But I feel like Taylor made balls should just be good. So I'm going to throw that in there. Callaway is obviously very good. Pinnacle. This is going to get messy. What is your favorite ball? She has big balls. I have big balls. But we have the biggest balls of them all. That's an ACDC song. For some reason, that um, uh, Jared came in with the What's Your Favorite Ball. That song is my favorite ball. But favorite ball, I mean, Callaway's are obvious. Anything Callaway's got to be the best. But I'm, I'm, favoritism is towards Taylor Mays because I hit Taylor Made clubs. But if I can get my hands on Callaway balls, yeah. Like this, this, this I, I wish I got more Callaways in this, in this bag. But when you get a bag for $15, you're not going to get a lot of Callaways. So I think I got three out of here. I pulled two Titleist and a Pinnacle. That's going in the good. Let's see what else we can pull. Top flight, top flight. Nitro Nitro is staying out. Nitros are good. I don't know if Nitros are like a off brand of Nike, like they come from Nike. I'm not sure where Nitros are made. Taylor made Nike Pinnacle. I definitely outweighed trash. I think I got my value for sure. Um, we got another Nike top flight, top flight. So Nike staying out. Titleist Callaway. Two Callaways I pulled right there. Those are staying out. Doo -doo -doo. Taylor made, I'm keeping out. Top flight. Or not, I'm not keeping out Taylor made. That's just a good. Top flight Nitro one. That stays out. Top flight. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. For anyone who has tuned in. Pinnacle, Pinnacle, Maxfly. Maxfly, I almost want to make trash. It's definitely like bottom. I don't feel like Maxfly is good. Top Flight, Nitro One. I have a lot of these good ones in front of me. I actually, I think I got a good haul here. Pinnacle, Tailor Made. So these are my, this is my good bag. So I got eight top notch golf balls. I have one. Two, three Callaways. I have two Nikes and three Nitros. So if you buy a dozen golf balls of a top-notch brand, you're spending what I spent on, the, on this bag of 48. You're spending 15 for top-notch balls like those. That's eight. So four short of $15. So do that math. That's good value right there alone. And then I got a full bag here of like good golf balls, where if you bought a dozen of these, you might spend 10 to $12, maybe a dollar a ball. And I got maybe half the bags in here. I might have 20 to 24 balls in the good bag. So that's $20 right there. Let's say these ones are $1.25 a piece. So it's $8.25. I'm not going to do the math, but I definitely think I got my value for sure i think it might be easier to count the trash ones these trash ones that you've never heard of before in your life in here there might be the last maybe 12 balls in here are trash 
So overall, maybe somewhere around 30 to 34 balls were either top notch or very good, like top five, top six brand that you could get. So if you think you got to go and spend. My computer just started screaming at me. If you think you got to spend a fortune on golf balls, you really don't. Because I got this bag of 48 and most of it, three fourths of it were very good golf balls. So. Thanks for tuning in. This is Dylan from On Out the Field. This is our golf ball unveiling. If we have to buy 48 more balls by the end of the season, this is what we're going to do. Uh, this is kind of your equivalent of people opening Pokemon card packs and hoping to get like a rare holographic card. This is what I do. I hope to get Callaways. So it's $15 for these 48 balls. I might have, if I repackaged these and sold them based, just based off of name brand, if they weren't used. You might be closer to $30. Might have doubled our value if these were all brand new balls. So I'd say we won. That's a win, folks. All right. Make sure you tune in on off the field. It's always posted. Follow us on our Facebook. Subscribe to our YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, all that. All right. Peace out.